Hello, everybody. Welcome back. It's Jill, your English coach. So sometimes we have verbs or nouns where you add something at the end and it changes and sometimes it doesn't. So here we took the word state and we added an S and made it states. Here we have the word need. We added ED and it's needed. Okay. Here we have the verb explain. We added ED and it's explained. So let's take a look. When does it change? And when does it not change the number of syllables in the word? You guys are gonna be like, what? Wait, I don't even understand. What does that mean? And then it's gonna be so easy, okay? So we've got a rule about word endings. We pronounce S endings in three ways. So we use three different sounds for endings. We've got S, a Z sound, or an I with a Z sound, okay? So let's see, for example, if we say fit and we make it plural, it's fits, fits. So the pronunciation of that final sound here is S. Work goes to works. And the pronunciation there, work, works, okay? Just an S sound, want, wants, perfect, okay? And let's do one more, wake, and wakes, okay? So these final S sounds in each one is an S, okay? Fit, fits, work, works, want, wants, wake, wakes. All right, let's take a look at some of the next ones. So sometimes the sound at the end is a Z. So let's see, how about this? Pay, pays, pays. Can you hear that Z sound? Okay, so this is S. If you hold your hand right here, S, there's no vibration, okay? So this is no vibration for the S, okay? With Z, pay, pays, the, the. It's a Z sound, okay? It's different. How about this? Read goes to reads. Again, it's a Z sound. Ooh, let's do this one. How about this? Climb. Climbs. Okay, that final sound, climbs. The final sound is a Z sound, okay? We'll find out, we're gonna learn the rule here in just a second. Now, we've got this third way of pronouncing something. And if you notice, in both of these cases with S, this does have vibration, okay? So no vibration, fit, fits, no vibration. Hey, pays, it does vibrate here. Now with this I-Z sound, we've got, let's see, teach. Here's an example. Teach goes to teaches, okay, teaches. So you've got, ch. this is the final sound, and the final sound here is is. So if you notice here, pay, one syllable, pays, one syllable. We are not adding a syllable. However, in this category, we do add a syllable. So teach, teaches. So we've got a plus one syllable here, okay? How about wash, washes, okay? Um, miss, misses, she misses her. Um, buzz, buzzes. Okay, now what's going on here? Buzzes. So this I-Z is the pronunciation of this final E-S sound. Fits, pays, teaches. Okay, so we've got a rule. So this is the final sound here. T, K, T, K. Those are the final sounds. They're not voiced. So you're going to use S. When the final sound is voiceless, we use the S sound and no, there's not an extra syllable. Okay, when 
the final sound is voiced, right? So think of like D, G, J, Z, B, any of those that have the, the, the vibration, that's voiced, okay? So when the final sound is voiced, we use Z and no extra syllable, okay? All right, and then the last one that refers to or talks about what happens here, okay, when the final sound is, let's see, S-H, C-H, S, or Z, we add a syllable and use the I, okay? So we're adding a syllable when we have those final, the sh, this is the sh, S-H sound, the C-H sound, S and Z. Those sounds, when those are the final sounds, so CH, SH, S, or Z, we use the is sound. So teach, teaches, wash, washes, miss, misses, buzz, buzzes. Okay? And again, it adds the syllables. So this is one, two syllables. One, two. You get the idea. Okay? So let's come over here and we'll work on a little bit of practice here together. Here we are, you guys. So we've got exercise two here. We've got the words here, one through 10. We are deciding if it adds a sound, only a sound, or if it adds a syllable, okay? So dance, dances. So they put it here, it adds a syllable, okay? Leave, leave, leaves. It only added a sound, and the sound is actually the Z sound, okay? Use, use, uses. So that adds a syllable, doesn't it? Plan, plans. One and one, so it, it adds sound. Plans, and it's the Z sound, plans, okay? Job. Jobs, it adds a sound. Improve, improves. So it only adds a sound. Okay, analyze. That's three. Analyzes. It's adding a syllable. Estimate, estimates. It adds a sound. Finish, finishes. Yep, it adds a syllable. Okay, and the last one, assume, assumes. It's just adding a sound, assumes. Z, z, okay? Thank you all for being here. Thank you, and I will see you in our next class. Bye.